so a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. And our live game is Denmark against Australia. Well, I'm Peter Drury and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. It's a pleasure and a privilege for me to be here. national anthem. Lineups we've just been given. And here we go. Tries a through ball. Here's the cross. Over hits and out of play. Try from distance. Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, I can only add that he's got reflexes that are in perfect working order, Peter. That was very good to watch. <laughs> he's dealt with that well. all about the quality of the delivery and they come away with nothing and the finish big relief it just needed better contact it needs to be just that high caliber it's been such a positive start i think the next step has to involve tucking one away and he's on his way he's come loose that would have sent it That's a poor kick by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. Schoener passes it through. Now the pass. Goal! Denmark! And Denmark score first! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Denmark get themselves into the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, and it was a case of, of good awareness, too. That wasn't quite matched by the, the right way to pass it. Only needed just a little bit more behind it. And he was through. Jedinak. To the left it goes. 
ball swung in. They've done it! Well, we're all back to square one, but I hope this game opens up from here. It looks as if it could happen. Oh, an absolute gem of a cross. It made the header simple. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met, it really was. Australia grabbed the equaliser, and we're all square. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Gets it back. Ericsson! That really should have hit the net. He's done well to tidy up the situation. Looks like a good ball through. Schoener. And that's been repelled. Get a through in. Looks to slip it through. That is a poor kick by the keeper. Been intercepted. Schoener with the ball through. We've reached half time. It's been a decent 45 minutes. Competitive, certainly, and a goal each. So once again, we're underway. Denmark playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. Despite this scoreline, converting chances would make a world of difference. For them. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Kruntelli. Tries a through ball. It's a loose ball. Now the pass. Goal! Denmark! And they get themselves in front! Oh, that was a close call, but for me, he timed his run to absolute perfection there to stay just onside. And he's still a lot to do, you know. But I think he's tucked that away really well. Denmark go into the lead. Plays it out to the wing. Well, he rushed into that and didn't give anyone a chance to get on the end of it. He's made sure that that won't get through. Is it in? Oh, surely that deserved better. Oh, that was a lovely little dink over the top just to get the runner in on the keeper. And what a pity, he just couldn't produce a goal from that. He put on quite a ready to come on. There will be a throw in. Schoener pumps it upfield. He's had a shot. has gone out well there's a lot of movement out wide now yeah you can certainly see that well I think it's a move to open the game up more whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now Ericsson aim forward it's one! They've scored! And with that goal comes comfort! A pretty simple finish in the end, what do you think, Jim? And that's what the game is all about, find space and finish, but we have to credit the pass to, to pick him out. Well, it's an inspired substitution, terrific move by the boss. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction. 
Denmark, and Schoener has given away. Victor Fischer. Gets it back. Let down by a lack of accuracy. Gets it upfield. Kia does well there. Alert. Just five minutes remaining now. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Schoener. Cuts it out. Four added minutes on the board. Fisher. This could fall anywhere. Battles to win it back. And he certainly caught him there. It's a free kick. Jedinak has been caught there. It's a foul. Added time is up. And there goes the whistle. Denmark can be very happy with a job well done, an efficient win for which the players simply did enough.